uh, we'll start with basic demonstration of BMC remedy. We will understand the uh, basic architecture of BMC remedy, how BMC remedy is being built and how it functions as an application for the end customers. So as you can see on the screen, we have um, uh, three la uh, layers, in fact, four layers of architecture for BMC remedy. So three tiers are for the application and one is for the data tier, which is for the database. So BMC remedy is divided into uh, these four tiers where you will see the first is a client tier. Client tier is a tier which where we have all the desktop applications like user tool, BMC mid tier or any other client tool through which we will connect to the remedy. The second is the mid tier. Mid tier is basically a web server which is uh, deployed on a particular uh, web server and then it helps us in accessing the application from a uh, from the uh, from the web itself then it uh, sends the request to the uh, next level of uh, ser um, next level which is the server tier so here AR system server will process all the requests coming from um, all the clients whether it's a, a mid tier it's a user tool or any other client and then it processes it it fetches the data from the database system and then returns back the result to the web tier so this is just a basic architecture of BMC Remedy and all the applications we built on this uh, Remedy, they function accordingly. Now I will show you in the system how exactly these are being set up. So this is, uh, first of all, uh, let's have a look at the uh, uh, AR server. So this is an AR server service. You can see this is an AR server service. So if in case you want to start or stop your AR server uh, service, you have to go to the services manager if it's a Windows environment. In case it's a um, uh, in case it's a Linux environment, then also the procedure is a little bit different. Uh, but it is somewhat similar to the starting up service in Linux. So you can see the service is here. And then if you have uh, installed BMC remedy on a particular server. So there's a folder structure created automatically. Uh, I'll show you that. So if I go here, CM uh, program files, BMC software, AR system, and it will have all the files relating to the AR server. In case you want to uh, see the um, uh, log structure, there are, that also is possible through this directory. So we'll not go much in detail into this directory. We'll see it in the coming videos. Now, uh, the second part which we have here is uh, the mid tier. So mid tier is basically the layer which provides us the, uh, which provides us access to the application through a web tier. So here we can see, we can access this mid tier through this particular URL, which is, uh, which is normally a URL we use in accessing a web tier, like uh, host, then colon port, then slash ERSYS, and then you will be redirected to this particular page, and then you can log in with the credentials. We will not log in as of now. This we will see in the future uh, videos. Now, uh, the other part of this uh, is the client applications. So in earlier days, we used to have these desktop applications like user tool, import tool, or uh, developer uh, tool. But now there are uh, going forward in the in the latest versions of Remedy, uh, we have changed uh, some of them. Like now uh, the user tool is not, which is a thick client basically, it is not being now used. Similarly, uh, we have some other tools who, which are um, now legacy tools. We don't use them uh, as of now, we don't use them. We only use this web tier to access the application. But there is one specific tool which we use and that's called Developer Studio. So I can show you this. So again, in this also, we can directly log in using the credentials, admin credentials. And this basically is a uh, console where we do all the development of BMC Remedy. So in future videos, I will explain you how we will do the development, what are forms, actual link filters, escalations, everything I will explain you in future videos. So this is just a basic architecture of uh, BMC Remedy as of now. Thank you.